Hi, this is Aaron from AnythingArcos.com, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can edit videos using the application Movie Studio, which comes pre-installed with all Honeycomb tablets. So the first thing you do is click New Project, and then name it, and I'll call this one Cat. So the first thing you want to do is either record a video, take a photo, use a pre-recorded video, or use a photo. So we'll go ahead and use a video. And you have to manually add the videos one by one, which is a bit annoying. It'd be nice if you could do a multi-select and get like five at once. So once you have all your videos, you can change how big you want the thumbnail of the video to be with on the left side here. Or you can skip and pause and play. So the first thing you want to do is crop the video. Or actually the first thing you want to do is position the videos in the right place. So I want to start out with this video, no, I want to start out with this video. So I'll just hold it and then drag it until the green goes to the first position and then it goes there. So once they're already positioned, then you can make the thumbnails bigger. And the next step is to crop all of the videos, or not crop, but shorten them. So I think I want to end the video there. So what I do is hold it, and then there's a little green tab right here, and I just shorten it to the place I want. So I'll end it there. And you click done. And then you go to the next video clip. And you just press play. And it'll show the video clip. So I think I want to end the video there, so I just hold it and then shorten it to the place I want. And then click done. So once you have all the clips at the lengths you want them to be, then you add the transitions. And to add a transition, you hold down one of the clips, and then there's a little transition button on either end. You can choose one of many transitions. Right down here, you can choose how long you want the transition to last for. So I'll say 0.8 of a second. 
and I'll choose that one. And then you can see it's loading. And once that's done, you know that the transition is added. So once you've added all your transitions, then you just let them process, and once they're done, you can add some music. So to add music, you can either press this, or import music, but I don't really want to import some music right now because I'm going to put this video on YouTube and video doesn't allow any music. So, we've added the transitions and the last thing you want to do is you want to add a title at the start of the video. So there's four options. You can have it the center tile, bottom tile, center tile, or bottom tile in blue or, or yellow. I'll choose center tile in blue. And I'll say the title is um, Cat Fight. The subtitle can be Movie Maker. So once you've done that, you can click OK. And you also have the option to crop it if you want, change the aspect ratio, or change the project name. But I think the video is ready to start uh, to export. So to do that, you click the options and then export movie. And you can choose the quality, and then click export. And this process usually takes about three minutes, depending on how long the video clip is. So I'll show you when it's done. So the video finished exporting, so now you exit out of the application and go into the gallery. And then the video is in movies. And there's the movie. So now I'll upload this video of the cats and I'll upload this video obviously if you're watching it. So that was editing movies on Movie Studio. Thank you, bye.